Hey guys, Flatback Effects here and welcome back to part 3 of our glitch effect. And in this tutorial we're going to be adding this static TV effect. So stick around, you're watching Flatpak Effects. Alright, so let's get started. So with my logo composition open, I'm going to come down here, right click, new, and I'm going to create an adjustment layer. Now I'm going to call this adjustment layer glitch. And I'm going to drag it down underneath my shake layer. And I'm going to come up to effect, down to distort, and then add this one wave warp. Now I'm going to set my wave type to be smooth noise. And I'm going to set the width to be 1. And then all I need to do is just simply scale this up while holding shift to somewhere about there. Next with my layer selected, I'm just going to go in a couple of frames and I'm going to come up to edit and then split the layer. And I'm going to delete that second layer. I'm simply just going to copy and paste this effect over my other effect layers. And I can drag these out to make the effect longer. And all I simply need to do is adjust my wave height. And I can also mess around with the width to get a different look. So that's going to stretch it out. So I can mess around with these to get a different sort of static look. And once you're happy with that, all you need to do is just copy and paste these over the top of your other layers. But also keep in mind, you'll want to keep adjusting the settings just so you don't end up with the same effect. The more erratic, the better. So there you go, that's how easy it is to create this effect. So I've just jumped ahead here to some layers I've created earlier. But I recommend just spending some time messing around with those settings until you get an effect that you're sort of happy with. So it can even be a nice effect if you add that glitch layer over your normal layer. It's going to look really good the more erratic the layout. So there you go guys, that was part 3 of our glitch effect. I hope you've enjoyed it and stay tuned for more great tutorials.